Hey guys, Llama Modder here with a very quick and short review. I didn't get to do an unboxing because I just didn't have time for when I was doing it. Um, today is the Butt Kicker Gamer 2. And this is this is a very unique, well, I don't want to say very unique product, but a very different product. This is actually for simulating basically what you would consider a base in your system. Or if you play like a racing game or something like Rumble and things. So it's kind of like a it's kind of like a rumble for your chair, and so like when you have on your controller, basically lock it to your chair. Huge ass thumper on the back, really good frame system makes it really nice and light, and it just thumps your chair. Uh, it kicks it basically. It's a it's not a simple product. It does have an amp over here which I'm not going to show, including a remote, but that's all stuff you'll get with it. That's their own amplifier. Um, so I want to just do a really quick review on what I thought of it. So when I when I first opened it, the packaging, excellent. Everything really well packaged. Lots and lots of material in there, making sure that nothing gets busted. As soon as you grab it out, you can feel the complete... I don't know if this is aluminum or steel, but it has an incredible casing on it and structure, along with a very, very, very nice clamping mechanism, which I thoroughly enjoy because... Some, play, some companies just cannot make a good clamping system. Uh, so my, my overall thoughts of the product is it's amazing. I use headphones. I don't have them over here. I use Sennheiser Pro 200s, which are like their cheapest of the cheap, but they work really well. But this basically simulates what your sub is going to do. So all the thumping that you normally would feel through your sub and also create a huge noise issue for people just goes right into your chair. That is, that is my personal favorite because I hate annoying my parents because I do live at home with them still. So instead of using my Logitech system, this guy covers everything I need along with my headphones. And for a race, I haven't played many games with it just because I don't primarily play PC games much anymore. I will do a little bit of testing with it and give my thoughts like on the Facebook post, but not right now in this video because I just haven't tested it yet. But you're basically going to be able to feel any kind of rumbling that you're going to feel in the game, such as like hitting a bump, hitting a pebble, hitting really anything, and it's very accurate. And I know some people have gotten, I'm not exactly sure if they have a smaller version of this, but they do have another version, I think, that you get four of them, and you feel it like as if you have all four wheels driving. They're insanely cool. Some people don't find them worth the price. Some people do. I find it really worth the price for what you get, because you get both... You get basically the entire kit, and it works extremely well. And it's if it wasn't built as high quality as it is, it wouldn't be worth it. But this is one of the most high quality products I've gotten in a long time, just because of the structure and everything and how well built. Like this thing will survive. Like I'm not gonna chuck it because that would be very rude of me. But you could chuck this thing at a wall and just pick it up, and it's not gonna have any damage to it just because it's it's a complete structure. Like it's a complete metal. Um, it's completely metal. And it's very nice, and you don't worry about running it over or anything. It's this, if y'all can see this well, this is a very, very, very durable cable, and it comes with a quick disconnect. So if you start like pulling away from the system, it'll actually disconnect itself before you pull down your entire desk, because it does hook up to your chair through this clamp right here, and then goes up into the amp, and then the amp connects to your PC and everything, and powers everything. You do want to make sure that you do not go too high because you will destroy the thumper in it if you go too high. So overall, I freaking love the product. I think it's an ex excellent product and that I definitely would love to get a racing sim in the future and have four of these on there. And I just cannot believe, like think about how unbelievable it would be to have four of these on a racing simulator to get a full immersion, especially when you get into VR along with headphones on. It's just gonna be immaculate. So. That, that's my super quick review. Um, I might go into a more thorough one. Let me know in the comments if you want one. Um, I just haven't... I've been going through some stuff. Haven't had the chance to do any more real videos. Tech videos are expensive and hard to do. Um, I don't have the time. I'm in college right now. Along with live streaming and doing gaming content. And school and Smash Bro tournaments. And getting good at that. It's just... It's a lot of... It's a, a lot of things with not a lot of time in the day, so this has kind of been on the back burner, but they were kind enough to send me this, so I wanted to make a video, and 
I'll make sure to do more in-depth written stuff for it. And I might I might actually release all the written product reviews I have, because I do have a few of them that I just never recorded. So I might just put out written reviews for a while and maybe get back to the videos. But anyways, guys, thank you for watching. I'm the Lava Modder. If you want to check me out on other socials, you can check me out on Facebook and things. Along with go and check out the Computer Enthusiast group. It's an awesome group that I help mod and a lot of amazing people. So anyways, guys, I will see you all in the next video. If you want to like and subscribe to see future videos, whenever they might come out, go ahead and do it down below and hit the bell icon. And I love you all.